And for many students, the decision made by Governor DeSantis was difficult to hear, especially for seniors. They told us it's devastating with not even just graduation affected, but also things like prom and the chance to say goodbye to their friends and teachers. Seniors are overwhelmed. Nightside's Madison Allworth spoke to four seniors who say that while they understand the governor's decision, they can't help but be disappointed by what it may mean. Like that, I just wish that we knew, like, you know, this is going to be your last day. Like, say, say your goodbyes. High school seniors say they weren't surprised that Governor DeSantis extended distance learning to keep students safe from coronavirus, but they were still disappointed. People you've known for 12 years and grown up with, like, you're not going to be able to say goodbye before your summer and going to college and parting ways. Major milestones most likely missed. You know, everybody looks forward to their senior prom and going, and now we're not going to have that. Kids moving on without a chance to celebrate. My prom was supposed to be uh, late March, and I got a text from the boutique where I bought my dress, and it was like, how was your event? And I just, I saw the text, and I just started sobbing. Social distancing is shutting down their social interactions. It's been hard trying to keep contact with all your friends. It's like, you know, they're there for you, but they're also just as sad as you, so no one's really making like a great effort. It's just kind of like trying to cope with what's going on. But still hoping to get a diploma in person. Since I started school, the whole point was to graduate. And I'm not really, I mean, I'm graduating, but it's not real anymore. I feel like we're gonna do like some online graduation at this point. I'm gonna have to print out my own diploma, which I don't know, that kind of makes it 12 years I've been doing, 13 years I've been doing school kind of seem pointless. Most school districts in our area are still hoping to host an in-person graduation and some are looking to host prom over the summer. But everything depends now on how quickly we are able to reopen the state and how guidelines adjust.